Isn't this something? Adrian Sainz, Lenny Supal joins us live in, two, uh, in Tampa tonight. You know, this is something we don't hear very often. It's about time, right? Are people, uh, what are they thinking about this? Well, of course, many welcome the change, but some are actually a bit skeptical. They say that their premium jumped so high in recent years that it would take a significant rate reduction to make it affordable, and some paying more than $6,000 a year for homeowners insurance. A sign Florida's soaring cost of homeowners insurance could be slowing down. Ten property insurance companies holding off on a rate change this year. Nine filing for rate reductions. It's good to know it's a possibility, but definitely it does seem right now too good to be true. Homeowners like Tamara Ransom skeptical after seeing her premium double within one year. If it's like 5% or 2% or something minimal, it may not be the help we're looking for or that we would need. People that have been having a find a way to budget for 20 to 30 to 40 percent increases, this is dramatic. Ron Assisi is an insurance broker with the Horton Group. Don't be fooled by the idea that if, when you see those rate reductions, we're realistically seeing reductions of a few dollars here and there, if any. A CC also says sweeping property insurance reforms state lawmakers passed in 2022 made a difference, but homeowners have been staying patient, still waiting to see results. If you ask the everyday resident, they have not seen a decrease in their bill, but there is a lot of good efforts that we have created and made. Representative Gervonta Edmonds says more relief is coming. This year's state budget offering homeowners a small discount on premiums. Will that even be enough? We hope that will be enough. We even put a tax break in this year for homeowners for when they file taxes that it will reduce their, their bill about $75. It's very minimal. But I think with the combined efforts that we've been making since 2022 up until this point, that hopefully residents will see a decrease in their bill. So encouraging signs that things are turning around, but some are also worried. They are concerned about a possible active hurricane season and what it could look like if there is a natural disaster and a widespread number of claims are filed. Reporting live in Tampa, Lenny Supal, 8 on your side.